Orkane, uh oh. Orkane's dead. Orkane cannot deal with Clover. This is a 70 30 matchup. Because Clover's fucking busted. Alright. We got a recovery that's Orkane, but better, right? That's the first one. This Nair does 4%. But the, pro but the thing is, it's so disjointed that you can just beat out most stuff in the game with it. So you just press Nair. Um, another thing is, her jab combo is her jab combo is bad. Um, because you can... Her jab combo is bad because you, you can DI out of it. But jab 1 into detail is a good thing. And detail in general is just really, really good. Comes up frame 5, you get movement off of it. Pretty solid option in most situations. Um, oh yeah, jab, jab combo does 14%. Just in case you were wondering. It's pretty solid for a jab combo. Um, yeah, teleport's not instant. Teleport is frame 15. So it's, uh, or it's frame 15 startup, but then it's instant act afterwards. So I can get act out of to teleport. Um, up air is really, really good because it has it has a uh, a, a late it has a late hitbox. Um, which is really, which is actually, which is probably this is really powerful. It can kill off of it, and you can combo into it and other things with it. Um, let's see, fair and dash attack are both really similar. Fair is interesting in that it stops if you're going below a certain uh, speed, it stops you. Um, so it's pretty interesting for calling people out. Like Orkane, who has very, very predictable options. And kills. Off of itself. Combos into itself, does everything, really. Oh yeah, and I have to talk about uh, Dare Cover's landing. It goes further than Orkane Down Smash. Um, because it goes double the length of this flare here. The hitbox goes double the length of the flare. Uh, so it's really good. Um, at landing. And everything else. So Clover's busted, guys. Uh, she's got a lot of really, really good options going for her. Oh yeah, yeah, her hurtbox has shifted, and yeah, her speed is bad, but you don't need fast when you have gut, when you have all these ridiculous options. Oh, and I didn't even talk about F-Smash, even though I've been F-Smashing Orkane this entire match, so I don't know if I need to really say much about F-Smash, um, because it proves in the pudding right here. Ah, oh, damn. That's my first setup. Um, F-Smash is really busted, too. And But on the contrary, like, up-Smash is okay. It's like okay dealing. It's like okay dealing damage, and that's all I can do really. Fair enough. You can just hold ledge like that. So I don't even say much about this match. You saw it. You saw. But yeah, overall, Clover has some. Uh, Cl Clover overall is actually a really cool character. They're just overtuned. Like they need some aspects. Toned down and need to have some hitboxes changed um, to match. Hitboxes, hurtboxes changed to match their animations a bit better and everything, but they just, like, all they need is polish. Their mechanics are fine. It's just, it's the details need to be uh, sussed out.